everybody, welcome to our channel. Today we'll talk about the world's first NFT game that combines RTS. This game is called Wars India. Let's see this amazing world together, full of battles, development and of course mini buses. I wish you a pleasant viewing. Wars India, the first non-replaceable token NFT. Esports game that combines real-time strategy has announced the date of its whitelisted competition. The project is really something new. The game allows players to collect lands and heroes to build air fortresses while fighting and defending the territorial boundaries of the Sindia continent. War Sindia introduced the concept of full ownership of game assets. Gamers can conveniently collect rare cards, build fortresses, and sell cards to other players. Also thanks to War Sindia, players can build defensive towers. Combining heroes, lands, building, and dogfights to provide a truly immersive and fun gaming experience that every player will enjoy is the main goal of Wars India. The project plans to delight its users with new content and now provides access to two unique boxes. In them, players will be able to find hero cards up to the legendary level, as well as various fragments. Also, everyone can knock out exclusive items such as ancient artifacts and an amber hammer. These items will definitely help you achieve success. A very lucrative offer is held as a part of competition to get into the white list. The contest, due to start on March 28, 2022, will run for 15 days until April 11, 2022. The competition will provide potential buyers with early access to the Boys India Weapon Crates pre-sale event. Boys India will give away thousands of dollars to people who participate in wireless contest. 5,000 Tether will go to the winners of this contest. One person will win 1,000 USDT, 4 people will win 500 USDT each and 10 people will win 200 USDT each. You need to follow the link pinned in the description under the video and complete certain tasks in order to participate in the competition. Don't miss this opportunity. I also want to talk separately about the features of this project. Players can create their own maps, including characters and other interactive resources. Each card is then saved as an NFT and made public. The map creator is rewarded when other players use the map. As an NFT, the card can also be sold, which will bring additional income to the player. Aimed at more than just creating a unique and fulfilling gaming experience for players, War India hopes to be driving force behind the growth in funding for esports and game fee. The new blockchain trend. War Cynthia will attract teams of professional video gamers and host global esports events with prize pools worth millions of dollars. War Cynthia is made up of highly skilled professionals who have worked in countless industries and released games in a variety of formats. These people know what they are doing, because it is thanks to them that such a wonderful project turned out. The production team has been actively involved in the development of Headstone, Stone Age Mobile, Goat Eater, League of Legends and other games. Wars India is a fairly reliable and promising project that is really worth paying attention to. You can personally see the project if you are interested. In the description under the video, you can find all the links you need. Thank you for watching.